So this video is a comparison of my four-year-old desktop computer against my new Mac Mini. I know, not a fair fight, but let's have a look. The AMD uh, Ryzen 5 3600 uh, with 16 gigs of RAM, one terabyte SSD and an NVIDIA RTX 2060 against the Mac Mini M4 Pro 24 gigabyte version with the 512 gigabytes of storage. I went for this one because I was probably would have upgraded the memory and disk from the base unit anyway. As it's got Thunderbolt as well, uh, I will be using external storage, so the 512 gigabytes shouldn't be an issue. According to Apple, though, it's six times faster than any sort of typical similarly priced PC, and the reviews online have been really positive from all of the YouTubers out there. Uh, so following that, I was straight down to the Apple Store, quick unboxing, really like the size of the unit, very easy to set up, uh, really nicely well made. And first test for it was boot up. And as you can see, it's booting up really fast in under 10 seconds, uh, nearly three times, maybe three and a half times quicker than the uh, PC. That said, I probably won't be turning it on and off much with its low power and oddly placed uh, on off switch. Okay, moving on to the CPU over double the single core performance and nearly three times and more than three times uh, the multi-core performance. So things are looking good. GPU though, uh, the 2060 inside of the AMD machine though is outperforming the integrated GPU as you would kind of expect. What do I do? Well, lots of applications for typical you know, Word, PowerPoint, Teams, etc. We use Office at work, so these are the apps that I'm loading up here. Nice and quickly on the new Mac Mini, five seconds compared to 13, a big clear win. Why? Well, that's because the internal disk uh, speeds are so much faster, over double the sort of, well over double, two and a half times the performance and a massive difference on external drives as well, which would mean uh, that they are fast enough to just use for things like video editing, etc. on an external drive. Next, spend, spend a lot of time on the web. Uh, so let's run a browser benchmark here. Um, obviously, the single core performance being so much better on the CPU should lead to much better browser performance. And there we go, uh, nearly a four, to, four times better according to the browser benchmark score. Uh, as a, a teacher, I do quite a lot of video editing to for tutorials for students, uh, and I use Camtasia for that. Uh, as you can see, we've just loaded up a project in 17 seconds on the Mac Mini, and it's still sort of loading on the PC. This is one area where I really did want to see an important improvement. And whilst video editing, well, this video, for example, it was so much kind of easier on the timeline and so much more responsive on the Mac compared to the PC. There was one surprise though, the exporting of a, a video is slower, um, but then when I think about it, that's going to be down to the uh, integrated GPU on the Mac Mini compared to the, uh, the dedicated GPU inside the AMD machine. I do wonder as well, maybe if Camtasia haven't really done uh, all of the work that they could do to improve the performance on the, on the Mac version of Camtasia. So final thoughts, we knew it wasn't going to be a fair fight and it wasn't uh, definitely enjoying using the Mac Mini. It's definitely a lot snappier and a lot quicker. Final thoughts though, uh, I just want to try and get used to using MacOS a bit more uh, and who knows, that could be the next video. Hope you enjoyed watching. Thank you.